So what's happening right now is they're debating a resolution that Christine Pelosi had introduced about banning corporate lobbyists from the Democratic Party. Now, this is a ban that existed in the Democratic Party up until the presidential cycle under Obama. It was called the Obama lobbyist ban. And now they're debating whether or not they want to continue to uh, accept money from corporate lobbyists. Now, there's some been some debate about where they're going to find the money because they need to raise all this money uh, to win races. But of course, we've seen DNC chair candidates debate this. And the question, I think, is not so much about where the money is going to come from, but where the money is going. Uh, I think that's what a lot of DNC members are concerned with. But uh, they seem to have differences of opinions. And um, this was a ban up until eight months ago. Ms. Pelosi. Madam Chair, my colleagues. A month ago, I asked every candidate for chair whether they supported reviving President Obama's ban on corporate donations to the DNC. We met in the resolutions committee with the committee members having two weeks notice to read, reflect, and discuss. We passed the resolution unanimously. However, yesterday, issues came up on the floor. After that, I specifically made amendments, which you see in the manager's amendment to make sure that we had addressed those concerns. I believe this body should have the opportunity to debate the work that we did. We are colleagues, we are supposed to work collaboratively, and I don't think that we would, should have a position where we're shutting down debate rather than expanding the debate at a time when the country is looking to us to make sure that we're prioritizing people. Yes. Am I understanding correctly that this measure would say that any corporate lobbyists be there for Planned Parenthood, like my colleague who works really, really hard, or for any of our wonderful labor unions who support us, any of those lobbyists would be excluded from off participation in this body? This resolution provides us an important opportunity to send a message to the people of this country as to our values and who we are as Democrats. I belong to the party of the people, and the last time I checked, corporations aren't people. Vote no. I don't think federal corporate lobbyists, however defined, should be uh, precluded from participating in Democratic Party affairs, especially at the Democratic National Committee, number one. Number two is corporations is a very broad definition, and I agree with the previous speaker that we need to, if we're going to focus on this, we need to have a serious discussion about what it is. Strike it. I feel that corporations are not a priori villains in our country. They are a major part contributor to our economy and they employ a majority of American workers. In addition, many corporations, in fact, most corporations are small mom and pop shops who have chosen to incorporate for insurance, liability, or tax reasons. I certainly agree with the goal of limiting the, the impact of big money and politics, but I feel that we can achieve this in a different way than vilifying corporations. It is not something new. We operated this way for seven years, and it's time for us to bring back this ban. I urge you to include this resolution in the work of what we do today. You know, this last election cycle, there was a fire lit under the voters of the American people. They got involved, they came out, and they supported a message to get money out of politics. And those voters, they may have not all showed up at this last election cycle, but we're going to need them. We're going to absolutely need all those people. And then we're not even talking about a lot of money here. When you look at the numbers, you know, it's not even worth it. And I've, I've been looking at it. It's not even worth it. We need the votes a lot more than we need a little bit of corporate money. It is now time for us to vote on whether or not to strike it from the resolutions package. So all those in favor of, of striking this from the package uh, by a vote of yes, please stand. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Sit down. All of those who would like to keep it in the package, vote and vote no to leave it in the package, please stand. It appears that the motion to strike uh, carried. Thank you.